something is off, but you just can't quite put your finger on it. And I'm hearing like word choices, mannerisms, and body language have been giving you what my team is calling red flags. And they're saying like you keep checking your blind spot because you think you're missing something. Like your spidey senses and your intuition just keep tugging at you. And you're noticing what's being called patterns of the past. Particularly in like a relationship space. And I'm hearing that this is a no better, do better moment for you. And you're being asked to hold firm on the boundaries that you've set. And I'm getting this awareness of like poking holes in narratives that have been spun to you. But I'm also picking up on like that this other person is revisiting a karmic lesson and they too are at a no better, do better moment. This is almost what's being referenced as a karmic purge for both of you. Should you choose to confront the parts and pieces of yourselves that you have denied repeatedly, this piece is crucial to ending a lifetime of cycles. However, your tactics and reactions from the past will produce past results. And I keep getting the sense that this is somebody that you've been growing with. And I'm getting like, you're not quite ready to throw in the towel. And I'm hearing for good reason. You're like, grow with me or get out of my way. Build with me. And I'm just being guided to remind you to be aware of what you're consenting to. Make sure that your words and your actions match. Address what you need to. Speak your peace. And then sit in the seat of the observer and you'll be shown exactly what you need to see. This is all about communicating effectively and efficiently. It may be perceived as, I don't want to say fighting, but you know kind of when you address something and you're like, hey, this is bothering me. I'm bringing this to the table. Like, let's put this to bed type of deal. It may almost be perceived as a fight. But it's only a fight because you're holding someone else accountable. And that's why I said these are no better, do no better, do better moments for both of you. And this is where you both end a pattern should you choose. <clears throat> Don't stuff it this time because you're a stuffer. You used to sit silently and let things fester and let things build up. Your test is to communicate effectively. It is to address the things that are in your awareness, that are in your field. And do so without reacting. You got this. Love you guys.